Hey guys, it's me Josie and I'm back with a video today and this video is a little bit different from what I normally do and it is a story time video of how my iPod 6 fell in the toilet. Also, if you are new to here, please like this video and subscribe, that would really mean a lot and let's get started onto the video. So it was nighttime, and I didn't remember that I put my iPod in my back pocket of my jeans and I had to go to the bathroom really bad. And I always do this, which is really annoying, which I shouldn't do, where, like, I would hold my pee and then I would just go at the last minute when I had to, like, go really, really, really bad. So I ran to our my nearest bathroom, which was on the second floor and the guest bathroom, really. And I hurried up and pulled down my pants. And I had forgotten that I put my iPod in my pocket because right when I sat down, I heard this clunk and I didn't think anything of it. I was just like, what is that, you know? And then I peed and stuff, you know? But I don't remember there being toilet paper in there because, yeah, that's weird. <laughs> but I got up and I saw my dear iPod in the toilet and I freaked out because I didn't think that would happen like I guess that was the clunk noise so I hurry up and grabbed my iPod out of the toilet and it was all wet so I took off the case threw it in the trash can that was next to the toilet and I hurry up and I didn't actually really hurry because my like brother you could say he was there and I told him about it because I but I didn't want him to tell my mom so there was a little bit time for the water to sink in really good to the iPod. Plus, it was pee water, and my my pee was actually pretty clear. That was kind of TMI because I drink a lot of water because I'm thirsty. Like, you know, yeah. So then my mom, I finally told my mom, like, it was like in the time span of the water going into the iPod of two minutes. So I got this big sack of rice to put it in because I heard that that'll work. And this is how much my little sister put in. And then my iPod here is in this case, this steer case, looking all brand new and stuff, even though it's not. And I'm probably just going to use this for skits or something. Here's the iPod. It's looking pretty normal and it was just in the sack of rice for a while until I checked on it and when I checked on it it was inside of the bag zipped up never opened and I just pressed the button to see if it worked it didn't work I was like wink wink so I was really hoping that it'll work so then I tried using the power button it didn't work the home button it didn't work so there goes my iPod but now I just have my iPhone 5C because I had both of these and then I used both because I didn't, I couldn't choose, you know. And then about like a week or so later, my brother, like my brother, you know, we were fishing and we had a bucket of water. They were throwing a water bottle in and then my brother got up and he forgot he had his phone in his lap. So he dropped his phone into the water, hurried up and grabbed it out and luckily his phone was saved by fishy water because there was live bait in the water you know and the scales and stuff and it ended up working for him and then he said at one point it did shut off and he tried using both buttons so then it gave me the idea to use both and it didn't work as you can see if I hold it down for a couple of seconds it won't turn on and I haven't even had this thing for one year and I was planning on having it for like three years you know so that's the story of my iPod being gone so now I just have my iPhone 5C, which was originally for school for me and my brother, but he got an iPhone 4, so he downgraded. But yeah. So that is the story of my iPod falling in the toilet. And this was the iPod Touch 6 in the gold one in 32 gigabytes. And now it's gone. But I'm still going to keep it though, because it's pretty cool, you know? So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick story time of how my iPod fell in the toilet and now it doesn't work. Um, lesson learned, don't put your device thing in the back pocket of your pocket because then you won't remember. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, please like this video, subscribe, and comment down below if you've ever dropped in anything in the toilet. And hopefully it wasn't your phone or something like that, you know. So I will see you guys on my next video. Thanks for watching and bye!